What's up guys, NBA talk, yes, I'm um, finally putting some NBA news, um, it's been a very while, um, the preseason is still going, um, next week we'll finally have our regular season starting, so brace yourself, we're going to have a lot of basketball coming up in the future, so that's for then. Um, right now, today, made official because it was rumored big time um, yesterday, but it's not official. The Milwaukee Bucks trade point guard Michael Carter-Williams, the former Rookie of the Year, uh, to the Chicago Bulls for this forward, Tony Snell. Um, now, Michael Carter-Williams have a real strange story, having a good couple of seasons even though he was at one point injured with the Philadelphia 76ers he was still a very growing point guard who seems like a, a triple double guy um they traded him I still to this day don't know why the Philadelphia 76ers traded him to the, the Bucks it just pushes the Milwaukee um the 76ers back a few a few seasons before they can become a contender um, in Milwaukee, um, Michael Carter Williams just got lost. Uh, he didn't seem like he could actually fit in. Uh, he didn't seem to be growing anywhere. He's just like in a standstill. It just he could put up numbers, um, but nothing, nothing could be done. Um, they pretty much have um, Mike Deladova, uh, Deli. Um, Taking his place, basically. And now, he's in uh, Chicago. Um, which will be a very good idea, though. Now that I think about it. Uh, just in case, um, Rajon Rondo does not work out. Just in case he does not work out. He could be a very good replacement. Because this guy is a triple-double waiting, ha waiting to happen. Um... It is what it is. So that's it. Um, Michael Carter Williams goes to the Chicago Bulls. Tony Snell, see, he's he's a good defensive player and he got a good shot. Um, in Milwaukee, uh, because they really need that small forward depth, because I don't think that they don't have so much people in the small forward other than Jamari Parker, who's basically a power forward. So. More to it for the Milwaukee Bucks and a potential thing for the Chicago Bulls. It just in case Rajon Rondo doesn't work out, Jaron Grant does not work out. We got Michael Carter Williams as a backup. So that's it for now. Um, waiting for the next season to start next week. I think around Tuesday, uh, October twenty fifth, will be the um, Cleveland Cavaliers and the New York Knicks and our other couple games. So, till then, basketball is almost here, guys. We're here. We're finally here for basketball. Peace out.